This tutorial will take you through the process of adding fields to an existing PDF using Adobe Acrobat Pro. Once completed, you can upload your PDF to the Inforama website. OK, let's get started. Here is a typical example of a document in a PDF format. To add fields, we simply click Tools. Under Forms, we click Edit. A message box has popped up saying, currently there are no form fields in this PDF. Do you want Acrobat to detect form fields for you? For this tutorial today, we simply click No. OK, now let's add our first text field. To do this, we go up to our top toolbar, click Add Text Field, drag and position into our document. Let's give our field name a title. To check the appearance of our text field, we click All Properties. At the moment, we see that there's no border colour and no fill colour. The font size is slightly too big, I think, for this document, so I'm going to reduce it down and I'm going to change the type font to Arial. To save, we simply click Close. It's important that we size our text field correctly within our document. OK, now let's add our check field. To do this, we go back up to the toolbar. We click on Add Check Field. We drag and position into our document. Again, we need to give it a title. And we also need to check the appearance of our field. Click All Properties. At the moment, the border colour is black and the fill colour is white. To make it visually consistent with our previous text field, we need to select No Colour Fill for both. And again, it's important to resize the checkbox correctly within our document. So now we've added a text field and a check field. This information is populated on the right hand side of the page. We see we have one text field and it's called name and we have one check field and it's called mail. To save the document, go to file, then save as PDF. So that ends our tutorial today on how to add fields to an existing PDF using Adobe Acrobat Pro. Thank you for listening.